Make this view even sweeter. For free You know what I love free things? And Budapest got that. If you try to look like a cute little vacation, long term vacation with a low low, kind of Budapest. Made it to my first proper stop in Budapest. And it's the Hero Square. And it's like a museum back there and a museum back there. It honors on the ground, I'll cut to it. It says like to honor our heroes. It kind of reminds me of like uh, in the States. Like we have like the World War II museum, like with the structure of the columns and stuff. Even though I'm, I feel like it's more than safe to say that this came first. <laughs> Hey, so I have a bit of a confession to make. I know I said this trip was a solo one and just going to explore more is going to be for Kayla's birthday, but she couldn't come because she's doing her visa stuff. But secretly, it was kind of a vacation and it starts today. I was kind of nervous for you guys to meet him. Um, I try to, you know, keep my private life private. I share things with you guys, but not everything. But it felt like it was time, you know, I'm in Hungary where he is. He's Hungarian. He's from Budapest. He's a Budapest native. So this is him, guys. It's my bae. Lubo. He's a bit stoic, a bit shy. It's okay, babe. He's, he's a little camera shy, so I won't put it on him. But, you know, we're official. This is our river coming up on three months. Ah, it's crazy. I'm so, so, yeah, just getting that all together getting that done just thought to finally share that with you guys so yeah love you
I slept so well last night and I woke up today ready for my first and only, I don't know why I said it first, like first and only full day in Budapest. Here's, here's a stitch, here's a little rundown for what's to come today. I'm gonna go get breakfast, gonna get a little acai bowl, you know what I'm saying? Then we're gonna go to the Museum of Selfies, or I think it's Sweets and Selfies. Yeah, Sweets and Selfies, which we're super excited about. Then we're gonna just sightsee like crazy, gonna go to the St. Stephen, um, oh, how do you pronounce that word? Balistica? Balistica? Then, like, all the, the bridge that, like, connects Buddha and Pest. Then, um, the Mappius Church, the Mappius Bridge, this street that starts with a V, V A C I. Then just a ton of so afternoon is all about sightseeing. Then we're gonna, then I'm gonna we you're gonna come with me. We we're gonna go get lunch at the Great Market Hall. We're gonna explore that a little bit. And if I can't get lunch inside, then just like around there, I'll find somewhere to get lunch. Then I'm gonna stop by one of the infamous very popular bathhouses here i'm not gonna get anyone because you know oh, it's been bad and no thank you no thank you i just swim in the ocean open water is fine for me and then we're gonna have dinner we're gonna go get dinner somewhere then we're gonna go to the ferris wheel to just see the city again get like a little night view of the city and then i feel like i had one more thing hold on what was it ferris wheel oh i think that's it Ferris wheel dinner. Yeah, and that's it. So that's today's plan. So let's get into it. And let's see. That meal was incredible. Oh my goodness. This place called Juicy and Bagel Bar. Juicy and something, but Juicy is the main, the main phrase of course. But the address and everything were really great. So now I'm walking to the Museum of Sweets and Selfies, which is only 10 minutes away from my breakfast spot. So I'm excited. So that is the first proper activity of today. Love those animals. Oh, here's this room. Oh my god! Just my childhood. Let me know. Did you guys have Legos? Were you super big into Legos? Like Lego worlds and the mall and stuff? Did you guys do that? Let me know. Let me know. Let me know. This is for children. But I'm having the time of my life. <laughs> Oh, 
chose curieux, c'est euh, le long, le long de le tour, les du tour. Ah oui. C'est comme le, 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 par, le parlement. Ah d'accord. Tu oui. vois, euh, je crois c'est 90. 10, 90, 90, oui. ouais, je crois que c'est 92 de, de mètres, c'est comme le Parlement, car euh, ah. euh, les 10, c'est, c'est d'être l'égalité entre l'État et la religion, tu vois. D'accord, d'accord, Donc, Une balance. Euh, ouais, ouais. Donc c'est le patron, euh, le patron de les, le basilic. Guys, so I just left Stephen, Saint Stephen, right? And walking here, there's this guy in front of me. And then, like, every so often, he just, like, kept, like, looking back at me. And I was like, okay, awkward, like, whatever. I was like, stay cool, stay cool, stay cool, stay cool. Whatever. Tell me why. Nian came up to me as we were, like, we're both at the crossroads forever. About to turn to the same place. And um, he's, like, stopped and looked at me. Because he was standing right next to each other, like, you know, almost what to do. And he started speaking in French. He said, tu es français? And then he's like, tu parles français? I was like, oui, je ne parle pas français, mais je suis américain. Je suis américain, mais j'habite à Paris. And he's like, oh, d'accord. He's like, and he lives in Madrid, or um, Madrid, like a suburb of Madrid. And we just like continue to talk for like the next 20 minutes. En français seulement. Avec un petit peu d'anglais. Uh, pour moi, c'est un difficile pour le mot uh, certainement. Mais, you know, je ne sais pas tous les mots. I'm not French, I don't know all the words in French, but. C'est très, 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 je comprends chaque mot, je comprends les, les raviments avec à Fabienne et c'est très, 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 on the bridge I feel like this isn't half bad the lights coming from it but look at it though it's right there it's really cool so I'll double check in my research when I go back and edit this but either that side is pest and this side is Buddha or this side is Buddha and that side is pest but ensemble avec le point it's Buddha pest <laughs> so a little little history for you un histoire pour tout I love this about like I guess I'm noticing with European cities like the city feels a lot like Prague and a bit like Paris with just a main waterway cutting through the city and then everything was built with bridges to connect either side together and then just it was built from there like the, 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 the river whatever body of water is the heart of the city along with the bridges that go over it of course and then everything else is built around that in mind. I like that. I like that dynamic of European cities, so. Yes, okay, and then on to the next thing, which I'm blinking on right now, but I will share it with you guys when I get there. I'm at the Danube, uh, D-A-N-U-B-E River Memorial. Um, honoring the countless, I believe it was in the thousands, of uh, Jew, Hungarian Jews that um, were brought here by the Aerocross regime and were murdered um, purposely at this edge so that just by sheer force of the bullets um, so they can fall over into the water. Um, and I think just what really um, has me like the most shook up is just realizing that like and I did a little research on it but just seeing it to you like all the different shoe sizes um, so it's like you know of course there's like you know mothers, fathers, grandparents but also children that were there too Ah, yeah. And, um, I am crying again. I don't know why I'm emotional. I just think, like, there's so much hate in the world. And I just, like, it's overwhelming sometimes. 
and it feels like we'll make like two steps forward and then like the biggest step back but this is still good in the world even though it feels like history's repeating itself sometimes you know but uh, oh yeah that's just so great and it's really ironic too i don't know if whatever came first but the parliament building which is like you know <laughs> a staple is right there and then the, is right there so uh, really sobering i um i do my best i can only i'm sad you see i'm just one person but um i just try to do my best to like spread love to people and be encouraging and like yeah you know, I have a lot of energy <laughs> as you guys I'm sure picked up by now I just try to you know be encouraging spread love because it's just like I just don't understand why I just came up so much so much hate in their hearts and just blame others for problems that <laughs> I mean you know the economy was bad so they had to pick a scapegoat and they picked an entire group of people to to take the fall for something that they <sighs> and then she just as a black american of course i have that i don't say burden for lack of a better word but just you know reality and know like my history and where my ancestors come from and what I'm a descendant of, you know, it's really, uh, you know, just the light stuff, the light stuff, we're doing the light stuff today, um, but, uh, but yeah, I'm glad I saw it though, and I really encourage you, if you, next time you come to Budapest, if you already come, if you're the first time, I do recommend you come seeing it, um, uh, better sweet, of course, but, uh, I'm, I'm really glad, at least to the country, the Hungarian people, that they've acknowledged it. Um, especially to Germany, has fully acknowledged it. Um, so that's the, I guess, the sweet part of the bitterness that comes with the bitterness. But um, yeah. Ah, okay. True cancer moment. I'm crying. <laughs> but yeah, so the parlance behind me. I'm gonna see it during the day. I saw it last night as you guys know and then um we'll keep doing more sightseeing all right i don't see <laughs> all right everyone checking back in right now i'm going so i'm out of breath i'm hiking up but this is gonna be like the best view of the city i've heard it's a fisherman's battalion battalion i don't know fisherman or something so I'm gonna head up there now, get a good view of the city, and you have two more, three more sightseeing, then get lunch. Distract up scene, fisherman. Oh no! Oh, why is it? It's been doing this a lot lately. The exposure has been off. Let's see. Ah, you can barely see it. Oh well, there it is. There it is. Just finished a fisherman, and now I'm going to the Matthias Church. And I believe there's a there's a church and something else. I'm blanking. Also, like a river or another structure with it. I'm assuming it's nearby. And it's only three minutes away, which I love about the city too. Oh my gosh, Budapest girl, you are cheap, accessible by public transportation, very easy to navigate, and everything's super close. Like it's all in clusters. I feel like it's kind of most cities, but I really appreciate that about here. So, I'm gonna walk over there now, and we'll 
let you guys see what's going on with the Methodist Church. You like. Is this Buddha or Pest? This is this is Pest. This is Pest. This is and then Buddha. Buddha. Pest. Pest. Okay. Buddha. Pest. Got yeah, Buddha. It. Danube. 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 Yes. He is the Danube. Danube. The shoes Pest. and everything. Buddha. Buddha. Got Pest. it. Okay. But we say Buddha Pest. Taco. Taco. I've made it to the great market hall. A lot of things are closed. I don't know if that's a COVID thing. I did kind of come late. It's like less than an hour till closing, but it's my newfound friend. <laughs> uh, was telling me about this place, so it's pretty cool. I might go upstairs next. Yeah, I'm gonna go upstairs next, but. It's a great place for like training and just picking up. Yeah, like just the ultimate like farmer's market. So yeah, let's go upstairs. this hotel are really famous baths like bath houses but it's a pandemic one and two not really in the mood to get wet like that i still have one more city left and in that city i will be using my bikini thoroughly so just out of safety reasons i'm personal reasons safety reasons etc won't be experiencing that quite yet but i can definitely double back you know i live in france living in europe so i need to go back but the pictures, I'll insert some here. Look really cool. So, if you're here next and you feel more comfortable than I do, come to. Oh, je le. Oh, I want to pronounce like a French, but probably not. G E L L E R T. And there's another one. Um, I'll put the name of it as well. Those are like the two main ones. But cool nonetheless. I say stop by. So, I've made it to the castle district. And again, guys, check out this view. Crazy. Literally every hike I've taken in this country, in this city, has been worth it and then some. I'm still trying to find this bakery that's really famous here. So that's really why I came up here. <laughs> Even though most of the stuff's probably gonna have eggs in it, but I'm gonna try and see if not. But there's a lot of other stuff too, so I'm gonna check those out while I'm up here. So down the street from the castle district, Guess what else is around here? Talk about a full circle deja vu moment. Look! Oh, after this bus passes. <laughs> Look! I'm back! So that's the Matthias Church, and that's Fisherman. Ooh, I mean, crossing the. Oh! So I just, when I came in, I came in on that side and stopped. I just like came up to here. I didn't realize all oh, this is over here. So when you get here, when you come to Budapest, I highly recommend you either come from the Castle District side or the Fisherman side. And then when you walk up either side, make sure you walk all of this way. Walk all this way down there and back. And then around. Oh, the more you know. I'm glad I got to Você, Sarah.
Hello, good evening. Hello. I'm coming outside. See Perfect. You okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Merci beaucoup. Hungry pour votre hospitalité. Oh, je sais pas. C'est la même chose en français. I appreciate it. I'm going to these lights for such a great addition. I want to keep this in mind for when you know. I don't get my own crib. Love coming down this hallway every morning. Love watching elites here. <laughs> the chairs, everything. Ah. Great trip all around. Now I'm about to head to the airport on the 102 bus. And then we're going to get country number three. Right, baby. Comment down below. Before you know. If you, may, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll know. But if you don't know, comment below what you think country number three is. Ooh, baby, who got what I want? 